Hello dear viewers, welcome back to Cybrosis. So today in this video, we'll be discussing about the lost reasons which are found in the CRM module of Odoo 17. You may lose some leads or opportunities when working with them for various reasons. You can monitor these leads and opportunities in Odoo CRM along with the reasons behind them. With Odoo's help, you can actually recover these missed chances later on. You can access the platform to configure the reasons for losing leads or opportunities by selecting the Lost Reasons option found under the Configuration menu of the CRM module. So I'm not confusing you guys. Let's move on to the CRM module and see how to configure Lost Reasons. So first of all, for that, what you have to do is go to the CRM module. So here's the CRM module. And I'll do one thing. Let me create a new opportunity. So you know where to create an opportunity. So click on the new over here. Here you have the option to choose an organization or a contact. So let the organization be, or I mean, a contact be Abigail Peterson. So the name of the opportunity will become Abigail Peterson's opportunity. If you want to change the name, that is also possible. You can simply write it and you have to put an expected revenue. So I'm putting 500 and then you can set priority and all for it. Okay, you know how to create an opportunity. So let it be of high priority and I'm adding it. So now our lead or the opportunity which we created is here. That is Abigail Peterson's opportunity. Okay. Now, if you want to, I mean, if you just open this opportunity, you can see you have an option to create a new quotation out of it, new rental. You can mark it as worn or lost or even enrich a need from it. So I'm going to mark it as lost. Okay. So whenever you're marking lost, you can't mark it as such and leave it. No, you have to provide a specific reasons. I mean, yeah, you have to provide a specific reason for why you are losing this. So why is it lost? So the lost reason should be specified over here. So you have things like too expensive. We don't have people or we don't have skills or not enough stock or whatever it is. So these lost reasons can be configured inside the configuration module. So for the time being, I'll choose not enough stock. And then if you want to write any kind of closing note, you can give that. Okay. And then you can simply mark as lost. So what happens is that there comes a ribbon called lost. Okay. So once you are clicking on lost, what you have to do is you have to specify a lost reason. Okay. And here comes the ribbon. Now, if you go back to the pipeline, you can't see that in the pipeline. Okay, you can't see that it's gone because right now it's in the lost state. Instead, if you want to see that, you have this option to filter, right? So if you just filter it based on lost ones, see, you can see the one which we currently marked as lost. Okay, so you can get the lost opportunities just by filtering it here from the pipeline. Okay, and also you have an option to restore it. So let's go back and I'll show you the lost one. Let's choose the filter lost. Now, if you want to restore this, what you have to do, you have this option to restore. Click on restore and it will go back to its initial state. Okay, so that's how you restore it. Now I'm marking it as lost itself. And I'm choosing a lost reason. Mark as lost. So I'll add two, three uh, opportunities as lost. So I'm just removing it. Here we have this global solutions. I am putting it as lost specifying a lost reason okay so one more i'll mark it as lost okay so you have this modern open space making it lost okay marking as lost so currently we have three opportunities which are in lost states which you can't see here what do you have to do for that you have to go to this lost stage and from i mean you can you have to filter it based on lost and then you can see all the three now, if you just take a look here, you have different views. I'm putting it to list view. Okay. So let's wait for it to get loaded. Now, here is the list view. Okay. Now, if you want to batch restore it, that is, you have to restore all the three, you know, opportunities, which is lost right now. Okay. You can go individually and mark it as, I mean, you can restore it. But instead of that, there is a way which is to, you know, um, restore everything together. So for that, first you have to convert it to list. Then you have to select all. Okay. Then if you go to the actions over here, you have the option which is unarchive. So I'm unarchiving it. Okay. Now if you just take a look at the lost ones, there are no lost ones. And if you go back, put it into Kanban view. 
and then if you take a look you can see all the you know opportunities which we marked as lost has come back okay so that's how you batch restore everything okay now let me show you how to configure the lost reason so for that you have to go to configuration and then you have this lost reasons under the pipeline section open that and from here you can configure the lost reason that currently we have three reasons like too expensive we don't have people or skills or not enough stock or you can put something like i mean you can add more re uh, reasons over here so if if it's like not applicable or something like that you can put whatever the reason it is you can put it over here okay so after putting that you can click somewhere on the screen and there comes a new lost reason okay so that's the lost reason now if you go back to this crm dashboard so i'm opening crm once again sorry so if you are going to mark it as lost again here comes the lost reason which we created which is not applicable and then i'm marking it as lost okay so that's how you mark it now you have one more thing which is group by where you can group based on lost reasons okay so based on lo lost reason you can simply group it okay so here is the lost reason okay you can add a new reason and based on it it will be grouped so you have the option to group it based on lost reason as well as group it i mean filter it uh, based on the lost ones okay so that's it and if you want to schedule activity for any lost reasons ones so i'm just filtering it here comes the lost one if you want to schedule an activity for this that is possible okay so click on this schedule an activity and then from there you can schedule activity for this so i'm going to schedule it okay see uh schedule i mean an activity is scheduled for this lost one okay so this is basically how you manage and you know do things regarding the lost reason so you can simply go to the configuration and then you can set a lost reason that can be used in case of marking an opportunity as lost okay you can group by based on lost reasons as well as you can filter the lost ones then i showed you how to do the batch restoring also so that's how you basically manage the lost reasons i hope it's clear for you guys thank you so much for watching see you guys in the next video